Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Kira Rappaport. I'm an early childhood music teacher and I'm posting music classes for young children every weekday here on my YouTube channel. Uh, please like and subscribe and share. So, I'm so happy you're here today. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. I'm so glad to see you. Good morning to you. Good midday to you. Good midday to you. I'm so glad to see you. Good midday to you. Good evening to you. Good evening to you. I'm so glad to see you. Good evening to you. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. I'm so glad to see you. Good morning to you. Yay, I'm so glad you're here today. We are going to be talking about some frogs today. So let's sing hello and get to it. Let's sing hello, hello. Let's sing hello, hello. Hello, 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 hello. Let's sing hello, hello. Badam 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 Let's sing hello to Aria and sing hello Valentina and sing hello to Roman and sing hello Arusa Badam 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 Let's sing hello to Amelia and sing hello to Luke and sing hello to Max and sing hello to Dahlia. Badam 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 Let's sing hello to Hadas and sing hello to Mabel and sing hello to Ella. Hello to Morakira. Badam 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 Yum ba bum bum bum. All right. So before we get to frogs, actually, there's a couple songs I would love to sing with you. One is our washing hands song that is continuing to be so important. It's always been important, but it's like even more important right now. So, how do you stay healthy in the winter? How do you stay healthy when it's cold outside? How do you stay healthy when the cough and sneezes fly? Keep your hands out of your mouth and nose and eyes. And wash your hands, and wash your hands. Before you eat, be sure to go and wash your hands. And wash your hands, and wash your hands. You can help yourself stay healthy, yes you can. Cough away from other people's faces. Sneeze away from other people's food. Bend your elbow, make a pocket, cough and sneeze inside And keep your hands out of your mouth and nose and eyes And wash your hands, and wash your hands If you pick your nose, please go and wash your hands And wash your hands, and wash your hands You can help yourself stay healthy, yes you can That's how you stay healthy in the winter That's how you stay healthy when it's cold outside That's how you stay healthy when the cough and sneeze Keep your hands out of your mouth and nose and eyes And wash your hands, and wash your hands Before you eat, be sure to go and wash your hands And wash your hands, and wash your hands You can help yourself stay healthy, yes you can Just remember please to go and wash your hands So that's my washing hand song. I wrote it a while ago, probably a year ago winter time I teach a lot of preschool music classes and I see a lot of kids with their hands near their faces which is natural for young children um, but I wrote that song to encourage everybody to keep their hands away from their faces and wash their hands 
Here is one of my very favorite songs to sing. It's Beautiful Day. So I think we have to acknowledge, even though we're home and out of our routines, it's still a beautiful day outside, whether it's raining or whether it's sunny, sunning, sunny, it's still a beautiful day. My friend Brock wrote this song, Brock Pollock, um, and I added the third verse to it when I fell in love with the song and he gave me the permission to sing it. So here we go. Every time that I wake up, and I see the sun is shining I know that things are fine It's all good timing Waking up to a beautiful life, yeah I know we are in for a beautiful day oh, day I know that the fun has just begun Cause I'm waking up to a brand new life I can make a change, I can make things right Land that I live, that I love Bring it in down, bring it the blessings down Till my cup overflows and fills out my crown on the day dancing in the sunlight their arms are open and their hearts are free like a bird taking first flight you're growing fast growing up right before my eyes i know we are in for a beautiful day I live in Los Angeles and it is a sunny beautiful day so I am not complaining about the weather though we have had some rain and I have enjoyed that too so let's sing Adagio Allegro we'll rock back and forth from side to side rock back and forth here we go let's sing Adagio it means so slow so slowly rocking to and fro. Adagio, it means so slow. So slowly rocking to and fro. And now we bounce and 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 bounce. Allegro, allegro, a very fast allegro. It means so fast, so fast we go all quickly, quickly to and fro. Let's sing it one more time. Adagio, it means so slow, so slowly rocking to and fro. Adagio, it means so slow, so slowly rocking to and fro. And now we bounce and 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 bounce. Allegro, allegro, a very fast allegro. It means so fast, so fast we go real quickly, quickly to and fro. So allegro, I know it's fast. It means fast. So when I sing it, I sing it means so fast, so fast we go. Rock quickly, quickly to and fro. So if you're doing it on your own, you can kick your feet up. And moms and dads and caregivers, if you're doing it with your baby, you can bring your baby back or you can lift your baby up. Lots of fun things to do with that song. So my friend Alex really likes the song Two Little Blackbirds. So we are gonna do that for my friend Alex and anyone else who loves that song. Are you ready? Let's get our two little blackbirds sitting on a hill. One named Jack and one named Jill. Fly away Jack, fly away Jill. Come back Jack. Come back, Jill, and we'll bounce and bounce and bounce and bounce and bounce and bounce and bounce. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Up, 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 up. Jack fell down and broke his crown, and Jill came tumbling after. Down, 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 down. Boom. Let's 
do it again. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Up, 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 up. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. Down, 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 down. Boom. One more time. Here we go. Cross your arms. Ready, go. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Up, 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 up. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. Down, 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 down. Boom. It's really good to cross our arms. It's really good to give ourselves some hugs. It's good to cross and touch our opposites. That connects our brain, and our brain is a very important part of our bodies. So, finally, I'm bringing out my frogs. Gung, gung, went the little green frog one day. Gung, gung, went the little green frog. Gung, gung, went the little green frog one day, and his eyes went bum, bum, bum. Gong gong went the little green frog one day. Gong gong went the little green frog. Gong gong went the little green frog one day. And his eyes went bum bum bum. Can you sing bum bum bum? Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Gong gong went the little green frog one day. Gong gong went the little green frog. Gong gong went the little green frog one day and his eyes went bum bum bum. So my little green frog, I wonder, I'm gonna put him here. Can you see him? Yeah, you can. I'm gonna get my guitar because I need us to remember this is very important. What does a frog say? Orbit, orbit. What does a frog say? Orbit. Orbit. What does a frog say? Orbit. Orbit. The frog says orbit all day long. So this time I'm going to leave out the ribbit and you're going to fill it in. What does the frog say? What does the frog say? What does the frog say? The frog says all day long. One more time, let's sing. What does the frog say? Ribbit, ribbit. What does the frog say? Ribbit, ribbit. What does the frog say? Ribbit, ribbit. The frog says ribbit, ribbit all day long. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. So, let's pretend we have a little baby frog in the palm of our hand. And we'll say ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit. I had a little frog. His name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water. He ate up all the soap and then he burped last night from a bubble in his throat. Ribbit. Excuse me. Let's go ribbit. Ribbit. Way up high will ribbit. I had a little frog. His name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water, he ate up all the soap, and then he burped last night from a bubble in his throat. Ribbit! Excuse me. Let's go ribbit down the ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. I had a little frog. His name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water, he ate up all the soap, and then he burped last night from a bubble in his throat. Ribbit! Excuse me. One more time, here we go. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. I had a little frog. His name was Tiny Tim. I put him in the bathtub to see if he could swim. He drank up all the water, he ate up all the soap, and then he burped last night from a bubble in his throat. Ribbit! Excuse me. That's a very silly song, isn't it? We're going to pretend we have a stick in our hand, and we're going to pretend there's a frog that we're trying to get to jump out of the meadow. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Can you stir with both sticks? Can you get your pointer fingers? 
Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. So I'm using my whole wrist. Let's use our whole hand. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. What about your elbows? Can we do it with our elbows? Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Let's do the other elbow. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Let's do our shoulders. Rotate your shoulders. Frog in the meadow can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Well, everybody, I think we should stand up and do some more frog stirring with our whole bodies. So I'm gonna move my camera and we're all gonna stand up. Okay, everybody, everybody's standing up now. I moved my camera nice and back so you can see as much of my body as I can kind of fit at this point. And so we're still singing our frog in the meadow song. Let's take our whole arm and stir that frog. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. And let's switch and do the other arm ready. Here we go. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Well, what if we used our head and stirred that frog? Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. What if we use our leg? That's gonna take some balance. Ready, here we go. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Oh, all right, let's try the other leg. Here we go. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Oh, we did it. Oh, all right. How about if we jump the frog out? Ready, here we go. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. What if we stir him with our whole body and spin around? Ready, here we go. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. Oh, we did it. What if we stir him like this? Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. What if we use our hips to stir him about? Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. I think we stirred that frog up really, really nicely. All right, everybody. So I am going to have us sit back down and I'll see you in a minute. Well, everybody, that was some good frog stirring and we are going to be using that song again. I have brought out my froggy gueros. This is a froggy guero. It's shaped like a frog and it sounds like this. That reminds me of a ribbit sound. I wonder, does that remind you of a ribbit sound? Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. So let's sing our frog in the meadow song while I play the guero. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. So here's my stick, and here's my ribbit. ribbit. So I'm gonna put him there, so you can see, because I have another froggy guero, and it's a little bit smaller. Here's my second froggy guero. It's a little bit smaller. Let's hear what it sounds like. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. sounds a little different than the first guero, doesn't it? Let's listen to the first one again. And now let's hear the second one. So it's a smaller frog, so its pitch, its sound, its tone is a little bit higher. So I call this the daddy frog, and I call this the mommy frog. And now I have a baby frog. Let's hear what it sounds like. Are you ready? Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. That's a teeny tiny sound. So if you were with us yesterday when we played the three different size drums and we found out that the bigger the instrument, the lower the sound, same with the flute and the piccolo. Well, so today you can hear the biggest frog has the lowest sound. Frog in the meadow, can't get him out. Take a little stick and stir him about. And then this next frog, the mommy frog, has a little bit of a higher sound. Frog in the 
meadow, pick at a mill, pick a little stick and stir him about. And lastly is the baby frog. Frog in the meadow, kick him out, pick a little stick and stir him about. So there you have it, my friends. We have big frogs, medium frogs, and little frogs. And I am going to move all of the frogs off to the side. Let's all read a book. Let's all take a look. We will read, read, read. And we'll look, look, look. There's a wonderful story to be read inside this book. This is actually a song, Five Green and Speckled Frogs. I told you we were singing about frogs today. Um, so it was, you know, it's an old folk song. I don't know that we know exactly who wrote it, but the book itself was illustrated by Constanza Bazaluzo. And it's a scholastic book. They, they took a lot of books and made them into um, songs. Try that again. They took a lot of songs and made them into books. So let's see. There's one, two, three, four, five. I think that might be my favorite because he's playing the guitar. Hmm. Here we go. Five green and speckled frogs sit on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One fell into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are four green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. One, two, three, four, four green and speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are three green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. One, two, three. Three green and speckled frogs sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are two green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. One, two. Two green and speckled frogs sitting on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there is one green speckled frog. Glub, glub, only one. Ready, here we go. One green and speckled frog sat on a speckled log eating some most delicious bugs. Glub, glub. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no green speckled frogs. Glub, glub. That's all the green speckled frogs. They all jumped into the water. One, two, three, four, five little frogs are swimming in the water. Swishy, 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 swash. And then again, they let us see the music at the back of the page. I will scoot back and I will play the music that they gave us on my flute. Yum, yum. So there it is. Green speckled frogs, everybody. So I'm going to invite you to pretend that you are a sleeping frog. And when you wake up, you are going to jump and hop and leap like a frog. I even found my guitar pick. I regularly lose my guitar picks. There could be worse things. All right. See those sleeping children sleeping on the ground. They are so tired, they don't make a sound. They're so still, so, so Wake up, children, and jump like a frog. Wake up, children, and jump like a frog. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Wake up, children, and jump like a frog. Jump and leap and hop and jump and jump and leap and stop. See those sleeping children sleeping 
falling on the ground. They are so tired, they don't make a sound. They're so still, so, so still. Get ready to jump, jump, jump like a frog, or a Jump, jump, jump like a frog, orbit. Jump, jump, jump like a frog, orbit. Jump and jump and jump, jump and jump and jump, jump and jump and leap and hop. Nice hopping and jumping, everybody. It's fun to be outside and try and leapfrog. So, that is just about gonna do it for this music class today. I'm so happy that you are here to join us in our frog lesson. Um, my name is Kira Rappaport and you can find me on Music with Kira. I am posting music classes every day on this YouTube channel. Um, I am a music teacher and since I am not out teaching, I am recording songs and classes from home. So I'm glad you could join us. Um, please like and share and subscribe. And if you want me to sing your name in the hello song, even if you don't know me, you could send me a message and say, I want you to sing my name and I will sing your name. And if you would like to make a donation for this class, um, you can do that through Music with Kira. Because there are not classes happening, I am not working, so that is definitely um, becoming challenging. Um, so what else, what else, what else? Musicwithkira.com, so happy you could be here. And that is it, I think. I like to close with this um, blessing. May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your way on. May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your way on. Hey, goodbye, gotta go, gotta go. Hey, goodbye, it's time to go, go. Hey, goodbye, gotta go, gotta go. Hey, goodbye, it's time to go, go. Hey, goodbye, gotta go, gotta go. Hey, goodbye, it's time to go, go. Hey, goodbye, gotta go, gotta go. Hey, goodbye, it's time to go, go. Let's sing goodbye, Arya, and goodbye, Valentina. Him goodbye Roman, and goodbye Arusa, and goodbye Amelia, and goodbye Luke, and goodbye Max, and goodbye Hadas, and goodbye Dahlia, and goodbye Mabel, and goodbye Ella, and goodbye Tamora Kira. Thank you so much for watching my class today. I'll see you all tomorrow. Ba dum ba da ba dum ba ba dum ba dum ba da ba dum bum ba dum ba da ba dum ba ba dum. Hey goodbye, it's time to go go. Hey goodbye, it's time to go go.